Hello everyone, it's Nathan. This is a different video, but uh, I saw a few videos on the internet that were showing the promenade in what I feel was a unfair uh, light. And it was disingenuous, the things I'd seen. I'm not trying to cause any like argument here, but I know the promenade isn't the same as it has always been. I lived here, I've been out here for 20 years in Santa Monica, worked on the promenade in many different places. It's always had ups and downs, and right now the promenade is in and up, in my opinion. It's doing very well. There's people out. This is a Friday night. It's 7 p.m. We're gonna do a walkthrough. I'm gonna walk the the length of the promenade at 7 p.m. on a Friday. It's doing all right. Obviously, on a weekday during in the morning, it's not gonna look great. There's different stuff going on. It's always been that way in my experience the past 20 years. So this is a video to show that Santa Monica Promenade is doing great and there's people here all the time i'm always here and there's always people here and stuff going on so this is a shot uh post pandemic of what is happening truly in 2024 in santa monica All right, so anyway, that's the end of the video. Just wanted to show the promenade, Barnes and Noble, all the stuff still going pretty strong in my opinion. Uh, no hate on anyone, just wanna show what I actually see when I come here. But the promenade's always been a weird thing. It's always been like up and down, so what are you gonna do? I think it's doing great. This is, a, this is the first place that was like my home because I moved here from the East Coast uh, at 23 and I chose to live here and it's like my favorite spot. So yeah, if it was doing bad, I would feel horrible about it and I would say it, but it's doing pretty good. All right, thanks for watching, goodbye.